Hey guys, it's Beyblade Loss with another video, and today I am going to show you how to make an iPod touch case out of paper, which is some certain kind of paper. So, it's not the touch. And first thing I want to do, if you have a case, you want to remove it. So, I'm going to remove mine. And just do it quickly. So here's my case. Put that aside. Because you want to make a paper one. So I might by the snore because he's sleeping. He's trying to sleep. Okay, so iPod. I have, I'll tell you what paper. Okay, anyway. Um, put your iPod. So first thing you'll need is paper. Well, uh, I have some certain kind of paper. And in the back, I have like writing of Beyblade combos. Just ignore that, please. Because uh, I'm using this kind of paper. And the bottom here, I can get a strip. So you need some tape, regular clear tape. Paper about this size, which I'm going to measure for you guys. It's about. About four and a half inches of piece of paper, you guess. You need four and a half inch of paper. And then, so put that aside. Then this thing, you need, it is, six, Five eight inches this way and that way. Um, so you might want to write this down if you forget. Four and a half inches this way, and just like I said earlier, if you pause back, um, I forgot what inches this way. So that. This one and if you have like paper like this, like uh, I, I just taped it, but like paper, let's see, like about this size, you have to just cut this. It may not measure it out for you. You need two pieces of this, just I taped it in the back. Two pieces of paper of five, which is about six inches, so six inches, and so six inches this way, and this way is five and a half. So I'm going to have this way, six inches this way. And two of those, which I taped it. Two. So, the thing you want to do is, if you have one piece, you want to fold it, fold it, fold it that way, one piece, and then the other, so first piece, fold it like this. Actually, no. Fold two pieces of paper like this that I just measured for you. Um, fold one, fold two of them this way. Uh, this way, right now. Okay, so fold it this way. Just like duct tape, but of paper. So put this way. So this part one, I guess. So fold this way, and then fold the other one this way, and then tape in the middle. So I only taped one, so tape the other side. Okay, 
this stuff. Okay. Now you have this. Then what you want to do is take your iPod, put it in the middle, and see if it fits. Okay. Okay. Mine's fit. So when you have that, this is only for iPod. Um, first generation to fourth generation can do and yeah iPod touch I mean so uh if you have first second third generation uh I think third one doesn't have camera but first or third generation you don't need camera and fourth generation you need camera so so this lay on the middle by the middle okay so take it later and tape it in the middle which you do okay so after you taped it remove the iPod so then you have this thing okay so now I'm showing my face now so this thing looks just like a pocket and then um, so, it's a pocket, so then you want to put your iPod inside the pocket, and then you want to feel where the iPod is, fold it, and then cut off the extra, which I'm going to get scissors. Which where my cardboard, my craft things go, which I'll show you later if I can. So put your iPod in the pocket and make sure your iPod is about right there, the tip of it, like that. So then cut off the extra. So as you can see, I cut off the extra, and you have this thing. Yeah, uh, iPhone case, I mean, iPod case out of paper. Put that in, and you see that. So now what you want to do is you want to... Oh, no. I need a marker. Oh, I'll get it. Oops. Okay, so this thing as I always use, you want to draw uh, the home screen thing. Well, not the home screen. Uh, sorry. I'll flip it over. Oops, turned on my iPod. Anyways, you want to draw the screen. So I would say it's about that. I think it is. is it? Okay. Drop it down. Sorry if it's taking long, but. Come on. 
let's connect the iPhone. God, so I've sort of technical difficulties here. Perfect. Okay, uh, after that, you draw the screen and then you want to remove your iPod. Sorry, on my belly. And then you want to cut it out. So fold it like this and then you want to cut it out. Now the first layer, not both layers, but I did by accident, but sorry. Let's see it. Oh god. <laughs> wow. Actually just cut it. Okay then. Wait, no. Okay, I now I get it. Now it makes more sense. Okay, so when you cut this, that aside, throw in the trash. It's trash. So then you have this. Put in your iPod if it fits. Mine fits perfectly. Mine fits perfectly. Perfect. Okay, so now you want to feel where your home button is. Your Apple button, press it. Okay, and then you want to draw your home button. Just feel it and then press it. Quickly draw. Perfect. So when you draw, when you draw it, Take out your iPod. Uh, see that? That you drew the home button there? Um, you could cut it out or leave it there. I'm just going to cut it out quickly. Which I can do. Sorry, my dad's watching WWE outside, which you guys might know, might not know that I kind of like. I have like a bunch of figures I don't even use, but it's from my collection, so yeah. That's one and oops. My mom got a note. So I'm doing this video with my mom iPhone because I need my iPod for this video so yeah okay last button for only on just put hole oh no maybe I'll just do this okay so uh, there was like maybe like a lot of layers but it's not open like wide but I'll show you in the next part. Check out for the next part. See you guys.